Hey guys, I wanted to show you one of these trophies in Block Ops 4 Zombies. It's called Perkaholic Relapse, and it's a bronze trophy, and it wants you to acquire every perk in a single game. In Block Ops 3, there was a Perkaholic Gumball that gave you all the perks. Everybody already knows that. And for Block Ops 4, it looks like you can only have four perks at one time on any map. So I was wondering if this trophy meant that we could actually hold all perks at the same time. There's 14 total. I was thinking maybe there's some kind of hidden Easter egg that we can do that will give us extra perk slots, or maybe when we finish the main boss fights we'll get a bunch of perks well that never happened the boss fights are complete and we did not receive any kind of perk reward i wanted to see if you could even fit all 14 perks on the screen and see if that was a possibility and you can see i photoshopped it right here it kind of works but it's still a lot of perks so this didn't seem like this would be the answer and it wasn't and we're not going to have any kind of perkaholic based on this trophy it wants you to acquire all the perks but you're not going to be holding them all at the same time to acquire this trophy you have to load up the perk secret sauce. This perk is locked until you get into the higher ranks and this perk gets you a random perk not assigned to another slot. And what happens when you put this perk on and you assign it to one of the machines, you can go up and buy it over and over and over again and it's going to give you a different perk each time. The method I used was I put it in the slot with the brew machine because it allowed you to buy this perk over and over again for 1500 points. If you put it in the tonic slot on the very far right, it's going to make that perk 2500 points. I'll show you guys what it takes to actually obtain this trophy and show you how the secret sauce perk works. So I did it on Blood of the Dead and I loaded up the secret sauce perk into the brew machine. So this is going to be the machine that's closest to the spawn and it's also making the cost of the perk only 1500 points. As you can see here I can buy it over and over again and it just gives me a different perk every time and sometimes you get duplicate perks so this could take you a little bit of time to actually get all of them. I had made quite a bit of money in this game and saved it up to do this because I didn't know how much I was going to need, but you actually don't need a whole lot. It costs about 30,000 points to cycle through every single perk, and that's with duplicating perks. You have to cycle through until you get 10 of the extra perks, and it took me 20 buys to get those 10, so you can see I had to buy like double the amount because a lot of them were duplicating. And again, it cost me 30,000 points to cycle through and get all of the 10 perks. One thing that's good to know is that this only took one minute to go through 20 perks and we know that we can't save zombies and the last zombie only stays alive for five minutes so that's good because this only takes a minute and you can easily get it done so depending on your luck it might only take you 30 to 35,000 points to be able to cycle through all of them also you will need extra money to buy the other perk slots and make sure you've got those done before the trophy pops up the secret sauce will not cycle through the perks that you have in the other slots it won't give you those so you have to go and physically buy them from the other three machines so I would recommend buying the other three machines and then going and trying to cycle through all of the perks and getting all the other 10. And after you do that, it's going to take about a minute before the trophy will actually pop up. So you might be sitting there spamming that machine and the trophy's not popping up. So you just need to give it a little bit of time, but probably don't need to spend again more than about 30 to 35,000. But I hope this helped you guys out and we'll see you next video. Thank you for watching Glitching Queen's video. Oorah!